All right, when we first told you about Adam Vosting and his dog Holland last year when they went on a once in a lifetime trip across America, now they are back and trying to give back to the very shelter that Holland came from. Eight on your side's Gail Guayardo has more on their journey. Yes, a simple road trip turned into a way to raise thousands of dollars for the Humane Society of Tampa Bay. And Adam Vosting and his dog Holland are not done yet. That's what makes Adam this week's great inspiration. Adam Vosting and his adopted dog Holland are back in town after a once in a lifetime cross country trip when Adam took a year hiatus from corporate America. We've been following the Tampa Bay Lightning, so we saw them play a bunch of times in uh, out west. We saw them play in Arizona, Vegas, California. Right, we went up to Winnipeg and kind of got some traction. Everybody that was following my journey kind of just fell in love with Holland, too, so she became the traveling dog. Adam adopted Holland from the Humane Society of Tampa Bay, and together, using social media, the two have met other pets making a difference. We had the chance to meet a famous hockey dog called Bark Andre Furry, who became popular uh, the year that the Vegas Golden Knights went to the Stanley Cup final a couple years ago. Um, so she's met Bark Andre Furry out in Las Vegas, and then we also had the chance to meet the Senators, um, service dog that's in training. It's called Sen's Pup. So we're looking forward to meeting Bolt, too. We've seen Bolt on TV a bunch of times, um, but she's looking forward to meeting Bolt, the Tampa Bay Lightning service pup. Holland got such a huge following on her journey, she won a $5,000 Petco Foundation Holiday Wishes Grant. It goes directly to the Humane Society. Now, Adam and Holland are trying to win the $25,000 grand prize for the Humane Society by trying to prove how pets can make a big difference in people's lives. She's really enabled me to come out of my shell a little bit too and just interact with other people along the journey. I couldn't imagine having been on the road for 16 months without her. If you would like to vote, head to WFLA.com.